Before you go, I, I want to uh, talk about the some powerful contributions. We spoke about it last week from first-time uh, MPs, and one of them this week who you uh, did a bit of door-knocking with, got to know uh, there in, in the seat and got, I think, a really good insight as to where this most recent election was going from spending time with Gordon Reid in Robertson. No doubt about it, Kieran. Last week we played, as Kieran said, a series of takeouts of maiden speeches by this very large group of new MPs. Today I thought I would show you an excerpt of one delivered on Monday night by the new Labor member for Robertson on the New South Wales Central Coast, Gordon Reid, a 29-year-old former emergency doctor at Wyong Hospital. Some might argue a person is of more use as an emergency doctor than in politics, but I would say from what I've seen of Gordon Reid, this is not the last we will see of him, despite him being in a bellwether marginal seat. I door knocked with Reid during the campaign, and that was a day I realised Scott Morrison was going to lose the election. Such was the ferocity of, of feeling from those we door knocked uh, in terms of their feelings against Scott Morrison and then Liberal member Lucy Wicks. Gordon Reid, who now has a federal seat with a 2% margin, relates here in his maiden speech what a night working in emergency was like and how it influenced him to run for politics. I stand removing my PPE and washing my hands after seeing a patient. And then I hear the sound of the bat phone. The doors to the recess bay open and paramedics are doing chest compressions and rescue breaths on the 55-year-old male that was found unresponsive on the floor of his home by his wife and young children. While all this is occurring, others come through the door. The five-month-old five child with a femoral fracture as a result of domestic violence. The 17-year-old in crisis due to a deterioration of their mental health. The 80-year-old presenting unwell, someone's mother, and yours will be the last hand that they ever hold.